Here we are at the uh, windmill of the world famous philanthropist Samosha Montefiore, uh, located uh, next to the community that was named after him, Yemen Moshe, right here across from the walls of the old city of Jerusalem. This windmill was the main part of the neighborhood of Mishkanot Sha'ananim, the first neighborhood to be built outside the walls of the old city of Jerusalem in close to 2,000 years. The windmill was built to give the residents of Yemen Moshe livelihood and was used to grind wheat. The great philanthropist Moses Montefiore built this neighborhood to ease the tremendous overcrowding in the old city during the mid-19th century. Montefiore was one of the most amazing figures of modern Jewish history. There's a museum dedicated his life in the Yemen Moshe windmill. He supported entire Jewish neighborhoods through tzedakah, charity, met with kings and with sultans in an effort to help Jews in their lands, and was knighted by the Queen of England and funded the restoration of Rachel's tomb. Montefiore always brought a Sefer Torah with him on his travels. His motto being, think and thank. Always be aware of your actions and remember to thank your creator. He lived more than 100 years and his picture graced the Israeli one shekel bill. Montefiore and his wife made many trips to the land of Israel. And today's flourishing neighborhood of Yemen Moshe is but one of five Jerusalem neighborhoods named in honor of Moses Montefiore. Thank you.